Alright, time to leave. No. We are now leaving the hotel for day two in Paris. Hooray! So I lost Kyle. Apparently he stopped walking and I just kept going. <laughs> Here he comes. Eating his baguette. It is cold and rainy. And I wouldn't have worn my picture outfit. And I would have known that before I got dressed. But Kyle didn't know it's not until I got dressed too. And then we had to leave the hotel. He's walking around eating his baguette. But now we don't know what to do. It's wet and rainy, so we don't want to walk all the way to the Eiffel Tower in the rain. Because we're going to be back in Paris anyway. But we have to go to a bus in like two or three hours to ride to the airport to fly to Rome and then take a bus or a train to our hostel in Rome. And then tomorrow is our full day in Rome. There's no time zone difference, so this time we shouldn't have any like confusing, like I don't know what time it is kind of moments. But I woke up so many times last night with like the worst like leg cramps. Like I got like two Charlie horses, one in like each calf, and then like my foot cramped like in the middle of the like bridge of it. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> back in the train station and we're taking one stop over towards the Eiffel Tower so we can go to the store to get Ebony and potentially Poppy a souvenir. I don't know. It depends if it's a cute collar or not. <laughs> but apparently he regretted not getting it last time he was in France so we have to go get it this time. So that's where we're gonna go. Okay, we now just have to go take the train to the bus stop so we can take the bus to the airport so we can take a plane to Rome. <laughs> and then another bus to the hospital. Oh my gosh, Kai, this is one of the first times you're talking. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm always like... A random guy. I didn't mean to. I was just trying to get you. <laughs> Anyways. Not the guy leaning forward. Okay, so I forgot my phone on top of my backpack, but I remembered within like five seconds because I switched it from the front to the back. Kyle goes, wait, where's my phone? And it just falls out of some mysterious location when he takes his backpack off. But we both had a small heart attack because like, you no know, one just would suck if his phone was left on the train or something. station but there's like a long line it's okay it's what it is
much time. We've made it to the airport. That means we're off to Italy. Rome. Rome, Italy. How exciting. But it's a short flight, so it shouldn't be too long. So then when we land, we can just go right to the hostel after we take the bus there. Train? Bus. Bus. bus after we take the bus there. because I have to take almost like everything out of the bag. Ooh. And we had to put these in a separate bag. Both of us. Yeah, they, they put mine in an obviously way bigger bag. Because they said our bags were too big. And then put it in a bigger well, bag. Well, yours, yours is too big. My bag is too big, but yours wasn't. No, you probably just have to use both of them because the like whole thing got marked as too big, so. Well, either way. Look, you have the rest of the airport. And then you have our gate in like a separate little room. <laughs> our little prison gate. <laughs> the metal chairs. What the heck? While we wait, I have to reorganize my bag. Oh my god, I'm so, I'm so pale. Um, I was playing games on his phone with his girlfriend. I am reorganizing my bag and then that's pretty much it. Nothing exciting right now. We're just waiting. The flight's not for like two hours, but that's fine. So I just got snacks. I got pistachios. These hummus chips. These. Also, Kyle and I are not sitting together on this flight by any means. I'm in row two. He's in row 15. He has an aisle seat. I have a middle seat, but I also have extra leg room. So... Live, laugh, laugh. <laughs> it's time to board our plane to Rome. Very exciting. It's behind us. We're boarding outside again. And on the front door, specifically, as directed by our tickets. <laughs> Our flight is over and now we are waiting for our bus that apparently we missed the last one by like a couple minutes. So we're hoping that it comes in a couple minutes, but it'll at least be here in an hour, supposedly. <laughs> um, and then that'll take us to the hostel and then we'll go to bed in a minute. Update. Bus has arrived. Are you excited to go to the hostel? I hope they speak in English. I think they do. It's better on their website. What? That the, the, the hostel staff speak English? No, I meant our guests? roommates. Yeah, who knows? <laughs> we'll see. I know. I hope they speak English and I hope they're nice and then maybe we'll make friends. I hope either that or they don't exist. Yeah, I mean, that would be great too. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say, I'm like, imagine we have little international friends from Italy. Italia. No! <laughs> we just got on the bus. Now we just have to go to Rome. Pushing into the 
scooter. So we made it to Rome. And I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little scared. Why is it so like, uh, there's like graffiti on every wall. <laughs> Anyways, we're walking to the hostel now. But I mean, so far I can say with confidence, I'm glad I did not come here alone. <laughs> We've reached our hostel. I got distracted. We have to come to the ATM um, because we have to put a deposit down to get our room key and it was either that or give them a valid license, like ID, like our license or something. And we were like, that's okay. We'll go to the ATM and get five euros. <laughs> but they said something about like, we couldn't stay in the same room, right? So we're in a different room tomorrow night. Yeah. Why? Um, I don't know, it makes sense though. I mean, that's fine. That's like a, that's not the weird thing. I didn't think it was weird. I was, I was just wondering. I didn't understand. I didn't understand what he said. Oh, okay. And I was like, I didn't know. I didn't say it was weird. I just they're didn't doing, know what he said. Either it's already booked or they are like renovating or cleaning their room tomorrow or something like that. I see. But yeah, so we'll get our five euros and then go to the hospital again. We're like right around the corner. Okay. Off to our room. One more flight up. Explore Rome. Sorry, my lips are so jacked. 